We're going to work backwards again. We're going to find the unknown dimension of a cuboid given the volume. So we're back to a cuboid instead of a cube. Let's recall the formula. V equals length times width times height. Let's use this formula to solve this problem. A rectangular container contains 660 cubic centimeters of water. Its length is 11 centimeters and its width is 5 centimeters. Find the height of the water level in the container. So let's take a look. If we look at our picture, we can see that the length down here is 11 centimeters. I'm going to label it with an L. And the width over here is 5 centimeters. I'm going to label it with a W. And we have a question mark here for the height of the water. I'm going to call that H. So if I set up the formula, volume is 660 cubic units. I could tell that's volume because the question says the container contains this much water, which is how much space it occupies, which is 660 cubic inches. So 660 equals length, which is 11, times the width, which is 5, times the height. If I solve this equation, I would have 660 equals 55 times h. And if I divide both sides by 55, I would get h equals 12. So the height of the water level is 12 centimeters.